Hi, it's Krzysztof from Ryan Tutorials. Uh, in this episode, I will show you um, my inspirational links, resources, data and other stuff. You, it might be also useful for you in terms of 3D modeling. So let's get started. I'm a product designer, so uh, all of my inspirational links I will show you right now is going to be about uh, product designing and uh, maybe a little bit of the tech. So, um, well, let's just straight go to it. So first crucial uh, inspiration for me was Thingiverse.com. This is like a platform with huge amount of the gigs and uh, uh, Givers, as the name is uh, about, so people are free uh, sharing their 3D models. Uh, most of the projects have their uh, STL uh, source files, so we can just download it and printing. Some of them are commercial, but you can really explore. Let's just say iPhone what they have for iPhone. So everything you uh, you need for your own um, inspiration, you can get there. So you can just click and explore uh, also how people have made it if they are sharing the knowledge. So this is great uh, platform. I love it and I really recommend. So the second one is uh, something similar uh, is DropCut. GrabCut is the platform for experts, for um, 3D models, uh, 3D modelers, and also very uh, deep geeks of precise modeling. So if you go and see uh, the community and library, I'm also um, on that um, blog with my tutorials and my files, so you can, exp um, you can uh, explore also my profile. But if you go to the, the library, see the library, let's see uh, drone. You can uh, download the uh, complex design of the drone, print it, and using for your own purposes, changing, uploading, and, uh, and enjoying the, the free stuff. Yes, of course, uh, give some comment and uh, in information about your projects, how what you're doing, and if you can uh, ask if you can download it and just use it for your your own purposes. I'm just spotting at all of those creators who are uh, very professional, and I'm also learning uh, from them uh, uh, new skills, and I'm observing how they solving the problems. So that's my insp inspirational link. I'm very fan of as well of uh, Maker Pro portal, which is great and full of um, like kind of tech stuff. I, if you know what what's Arduino is, so Arduino is just a prototype um, uh, electronic component, um, which gives you ability to create your own functional prototype. You can uh, you can adjust the servos, you can adjust the controllers, the, the detectors. And you can design your own functional object and uh, design its uh, cover or shape, print it, and close all the electronics inside. And also in here, you can probably uh, get some information how uh, to do it straight step by step with coding, with joining the cables. Uh, this is not much about the product designing, more about the electronics. Uh, it, probably, if you get deeper into the searching here, you can get a lot of the sh the, 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 the inspiration and a lot of nice, interesting projects you can uh, it, you can develop by yourself. This is more more open source platforms, uh, which uh, are open for all of you to uh, to develop. So I love that. I'm, I've been using my students uh, also loves loves it. I'm recommending especially those who are related to my uh, to my workshops uh, in which I teach on Academy of Fine Arts and Design, which is actually pro-social designing. So if we're having something like uh, 
um, detectors of human uh, breath, detectors of human beating, or detectors of heart heart attack, <clears throat> or any other <clears throat> or any other projects. So uh, I'm 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 just uh, giving them advice to explore uh, this portal. Of course, if you're product designer, you cannot not have printer. So I love Prusa uh, printers. Joseph Prusa is also the, the, the geek, but he is geek in 3D printing. And if you explore his, um, uh, his website, he really looks like he loves that. I love all of this. Uh, this I love that very much uh, that he's into it uh, as i am a little bit so i of course having one of those of his uh, printers and it's working fantastic so if you like that printer if you thinking about printing that printer see my link uh, under the video uh, you can probably get some discount with the uh, with that link and of course if you product designer if thinking about the cover uh, of your product and you, inside is going to have electronic the Prusa, Prusa helps you to, to print it and really uh, prints are really looking great another platform which I recommend it's Kickstarter Kickstarter is just something it's worth to go through and to see less I'm, I'm very fan of the design and tech in the, in the past my design was also the part of the Kickstarter uh, Amos, the social robot. Uh, we started there. Uh, so this is a platform for uh, for startups. So if you have a startup, if you want to develop your startup, if you want to get uh, f um, uh, investors or get the, the first like um, boosting uh, funding, then upload your uh, concept on Kickstarter. And of course, it must be at some level developed. But it, most of the time, this is great, great package of inspirational concepts so you can see what people are doing uh, over the world and see how um, how how much passion they they, they put into it um, and they also the a lot of companies like like grow grew up over there and uh, great get a great funding and uh, won a huge uh, huge amount of money and also another crowd crowdfunding um, platform is Indiegogo. This is actually a platform where your product product doesn't have to be that much developed. It can be concept uh, which people can rely on when and then see how you how you uh, are developing it. Uh, I'm not sure how about now, but I remember that you could actually uh, post uh, post the project. At the very be beginning of uh, of develop development, probably that's open. Yeah, so explore it. Also in many categories. Uh, of course, I'm very into tech and design, so I'm exploring tech and design. I'm uh, using uh, <clears throat> Space Mouse tool. This is something what helps me when I'm designing a lot of. Uh, Objects, or I'm designing. I'm, I'm working on some projects which long would last longer than just a couple of hours. That saves the time in it, and it's like uh, if you have your object. I will show you how it works because I am. I'm just next to that fantastic tool. If you have your objects, uh, you can uh, you can just fly around it. I'm using it. I'm just having in my left hand. I'm uh, I'm just uh, operating it with uh, uh, with my hand and it's fantastic. It helps a lot to work efficiently and to not get very tired during designing. And the last thing I really you I'm really using as a designer as a as a product designer is platform called Keyshot. It's not platform actually it's just a software. Uh, it's a standalone platform. You used to be a, a key shot. Used to be the a plugin for for Rhino, I remember, but now it's just a great feature, and it works fantastic. It's a little bit expensive for for the beginners, but if you get more uh, more advanced and if you if you if you just uh, 
have done already a couple of projects, you you can buy one and you really, really boost uh, uh, showcasing of your product uh, in front of the investor and does really great renders. Uh, if you like that video, I'm fantastic. Just give me, um, give me feedback, like it, subscribe it, share uh, your thoughts under the video. Um, that's going to be helpful for me and for others. Uh, and of course, I'm inviting you to, to buy my courses and tutorials, or like professional one, because uh, there I'm spreading knowledge how to professionally work with a product, with a product designing, with developing the concept from beginning to the end. Thank you very much for watching, and uh, see you in next video videos. Let's stay tuned.